Hello guys, you can probably don't see anything here. You can maybe see a little bit out of the windows. I'm not sure why I'm trying to film myself. But yeah, uh, I just had to clear my mind, go out for a run. I've been a little bit hectic the last week and uh, yeah, generally I don't really know what kind of direction I'm going here in life and I'm unsure what to do for the future but one thing yeah, I still like to make uh, YouTube videos and I see that I have actually got some new subscribers and it's actually up to 55 subscribers now so for those of you that have subscribed subscribed I am very thankfully for that so I think my main focus on this channel is been like doing things to my car and uh, in the long run there are limited of things that you can do to your car and stuff but of course I will keep on doing that I also got the DJ Spark just thought it was fun making some videos lately I I have not been posting a lot but I uh, want to uh, start posting more again and trying out some different types of videos but in this video we are gonna keep it real and I will try to let the engine heat up and we will do a 1 to 100 uh, run or 1 or I mean 0 to 100 and 0 till uh, to uh, 60 miles per hour so engine wise my car is a Saab 93 Sports Combi with a 1.9 liter engine with a turbo. It's a just a normal diesel turbo engine, and I got a tune on it. So the stock 8 volt engine of this type is 120 horsepower, and for around maybe 300 dollars or something that I paid like that. Uh, increased by like 30 horsepower and the torque also increased and I can feel the difference so it would be fun to see how fast I can get the number or the acceleration speed to be now other things performance wise there isn't a lot just a ram air foam filter I was supposed to uh, mount the whole kit but it didn't really fit this engine so I just skipped it and uh, just mounted the filter and as you can hear you at least get some uh, cooler noises from the intake uh, and uh, apart from that I just got the tune and uh, I'm not sure but a single mass flywheel also from the dual mass which is probably going to make the flywheel last longer but performance wise I'm not sure though maybe the flywheel is a little bit lighter so I'm not sure if this piece of road here is long enough but I'm gonna try holding the camera with my one hand with it on the steering wheel and we will see how it goes and I will not uh, rev it because then I will just destroy this gearbox which, which is already on the way out so just getting into focus there Because of the, um, the foam was in the way, and but as you can see, I was spinning a little bit, so it maybe was cutting off power, and I wasn't hitting gears perfectly because I really couldn't see the rev limiter and the. Right into the stone wall, but 
I was focusing on the phone again and hit the rev limiter a little bit hard in first gear. So to be nice to the car I would say it does 0 to 60 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers an hour in 10 seconds which is uh, yeah it's slow but more than enough for me though <laughs> and you have to consider that all cars with bigger engines in Norway are really expensive because of our tax on everything that is fun so yeah but now I will go for a run oh I'm so exhausted haven't had a run like this in maybe two weeks or something like that and I also forgot that I had a cold like three days ago so it was also really hard running today so I started off the run uh, down this tree line here and it's not sketchy but it's not a lot of people here I'll at 11 p.m. so it isn't too fun but I was thinking of doing like a 6k run kilometers but uh, I was too exhausted and I just took a big shortcut through the um, through the woods there and it was really dark and of course I didn't meet any if I had met any in the wood I would be scared to death and just ran the hell out of there but yeah here is my sub before the entrance here and thanks to the Nightcore NU20 I actually survived in the middle of the woods where it was complete dark and I would say it's almost perfect maybe a tad stronger would make it even better but for the size and comfort and weight it's perfect and I hadn't really got the chance to use it before today so I'm happy with my purchase so of course I'm not really the <laughs> <coughs> it's not smoking coughing there, but I'm not really the healthy type So I have to go buy some junk food after I had a workout. So yeah Food and semi-entertaining TV <coughs> oh, <coughs> oh, There comes the smoking coughing again, but I don't really understand anything about NASCAR other than they are going in a circle time after time after time so please ex please explain to me how it works or something or link a video or something because I have tried to learn it and get interested in it but I can't understand it <laughs> 